I came here because my predecessor had been German and uh, uh, I had met him before, yes, and uh, then he suddenly passed away and um, I was asked if I would take over and that I did and that was, as I said, 35 years ago. People were actually quite kind and uh, the neighbors were very nice too. They greeted us with a tea and uh, biscuits. Well, I would like to go on as long as I can, and uh, um, because, as I said, I met and made friends with a lot of patients, and uh, I don't want to disappoint them. So uh, they still phone me up, and uh, they still come and see me, and until they are not happy anymore, um, I carry on. Well, I would like to have them the best care possible. Um, either somebody um, comes along and uh, um, carries on the work, but um, I feel I have still a long time to go. because I live in the UK and uh, I'm the only one here and uh, as I'm based uh, in, in London um, I meet uh, very seldom uh, people, uh, class I makers in Germany. Most of them were German in the end, you see. That uh, seems to be a very strange uh, affair but uh, that's how it is. I mean, there's some Austrians, um, there's somebody in Switzerland, uh, but it's mainly um, German-speaking countries. The tradition, uh, because uh, um, usually they came from there, um, it was a one-man band only. Um, in Germany, they usually taught their children to do uh, class eyes, but uh, in my case, uh, my daughter wanted to do something entirely different, and for that reason, um, it perhaps it's not carried on as much here as it would be somewhere else.